Ladies and gentlemen, this is Gamer Tag Radio with your hosts Danny Pena, Paris Lilly, and Peter Toledo. Hide in Versio. Inferno Squad. Commander Versio. You must be important. All right, so I'm back here all the way from San Francisco. I'm back here in Miami, Florida. And uh, yes, can you believe I was over there for two straight days and I got to play the full game of Star Wars Battlefront 2. Now, before we talk about Star Wars Battlefront 2, you know, I go way back. The last the last game, I was invited to go to, to Sweden over there in Stockholm. And I got to hang out with the developers of the first Star Wars game, Battlefront, with the whole DICE uh, crew and everything. So that was a lot of fun. This time, EA invited, invited me and others to actually play the game. This is a review event. So I captured everything. I'm talking about the, the whole time I was there for two days. I captured everything from the game. So this is not a review. This is more of a preview. I want to show you some parts of the, of the single player game and also the multiplayer game. Piet, you fool. Get me Inferno Squad now. Let, let's show this, man. This is Janina Gamakar. She's a, a well-known actress, and she's been on our show in the past. A shout out to her. Uh, this is this is a major, major role for her. You know, in the Battlefront Two, her character, her name is Aiden Versio. So let's check it out right here. What's taking so long? Hydraulics are busted. Explosion must have welded them shut. Can you open it? I think so. It's over. Bunker is secure. All right, so Star Wars Battlefront 2 features a single player story mode, customizable character class system. There's also, it features vehicles and locations from the original and prequel uh, sequels from the Star Wars movies. You could also uh, we'll get to see heroes and villains based on the, the characters from all the Star Wars movies. Of course, like, for example, you'll see Luke Skywalker, Leia, Han Solo, Chewbacca, uh, Yoda. And, and this is all available, to, all available to multiplayer where... I, there's like I said, there's so much stuff to do compared to the Battlefront game. This one has way more stuff now, more than ever. And the game is scheduled to release November 17th this year uh, for the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and also PC. So Aiden Vizero, she's the leader of an Imperial Special Forces group known as Inferno Squad, played by Janina Gavincar. I gotta say this, Janina, I am so proud of you because, you know, I seen her, you know, working a lot of movies and she's done stuff for video games, but this is a major role for Janina, which is cool, man. Really, really cool. So we're, we're proud of you here at a Gamer Tag Radio, Janina. I mean, there's so many options for multiplayer. Look, there's Galactic Assault. You could play four, 40 players. Starfighter Assault. That one, you're gonna be flying around and everything. So it's basically two teams of pilots that take control of the fighters and bombers and so on. And yeah, there is objectives you have to do in there during the space battles. And that one is, believe, 24 players. There's heroes versus villains, 4v4, four, four four, uh, eight players in total. Strike two teams of eight. Uh, you also would do objectives based on, on scenarios, depending on the location and everything like that. That one is 16 players. Or Blast. Blast invites players to leap um, into a fast-paced, close-quarter combat. That one is, uh, I believe, uh, 20, 20 players and so on. I 
In preparation for Operation Cinder, we've been ordered to the Fondor shipyards. Agent Hask, you and I will retrieve experimental satellites for the Star Destroyer Dauntless and oversee security for Moff Wraith. There's a lot of things to do here, man. You know, a lot of things. And, you know, I just want to say thanks to to uh, EA, you know, to inviting me and everybody else there. I think there was like a total, like close to like 50 people. And we were playing this for like two straight days, two straight days. So right now you could download the game if you want to try it out for the first time. And I believe you could also play the first three missions of the game and also all the multiplayer available there. You could play, I think, for a certain amount of time. Go right now to EA Access right now and download this and check it out and let us know what you think. All right. Once again, thanks a lot to EA, and I'll see you until next time.